Hi everyone and today we are back with another genius box kit. This is the wiggle bot kit. So first so we'll begin with the first bot. This is the Tinker bot. So we have to begin with inserting the sketch pen into the base plate like so. You have to make sure it's all really balanced. Also, another big part to make sure is that it can't be like these caps cannot touch the base plate. There has to be some distance in them, otherwise your bot won't work. Otherwise your bot won't work. And we have to keep these, the sketch pins at the back, one hole in front of the four corners that that is that they should could or whatever be in i'm gonna take this which is the motor assembly we're gonna keep this right there next we're gonna take this this is the battery case it, it has two double A batteries inside. So we have to, first we have to make sure it's turned off. And then you can insert this right here. And one of the last steps is that you have to take this. This is called a tooth gear. This is a 40 size tooth gear. You have to take at the back hole here should be coming on top of this mode but 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 there should be a bit of space between the screw and the tooth gear like over which is over there so after that we have to take we have to stick the battery case on here like So, oops. You have to make sure that the on-off is facing this side exactly there where it should be at about that point. And for the last step, remove the tape that is here and over it and like that you have your tinker box. So now we're gonna watch the wiggle bots move. We're going to show you how to make the hoverboard. So we'll start by taking once again the base plate and then we have to make sure that the ones with the two tapes here have to be at the top side and this has to be at the bottom. Next we have to take the motor assembly and stick it at the far most corner. You have to make sure that the top of the motor assembly rotator has to be slightly raised. Then, next part, you have to take the sponge. You're gonna stick this most scruffy side of the sponge over there. See? Stuck. Next part, you have to take this, the front of the bot. If you're gonna take the battery case and we'll put it over here. Remember the battery case has to face this this side like that. You can press down and yeah. So the last part is to um, the last part is you take another 42 gear and the opposite side of uh, this here you have to stick 
right in like so. Once again, you have to make sure there's some distance between the screw and the tooth. And for the magic to happen, stick these together and now we're gonna see how the hoverbot moves. So, place it down. Give it a sec. Give it one second. Then pick it up and. We're back with the making of another genius box wiggle box. This is the clock bot. So, first we will take our base plate and we'll have to take the, the battery. So, you move the tape here and you have to make sure it's not just facing this side but also it has to be pointed this way at exactly like this like take the body of the wiggle bot and maybe a tape here you have to take out the tape and spot sticks together just like so then we will take the motor assembly and screw it right about like so take out the battery cord and you have to you have to connect Now we're going to see how the clock bot moves. 